Hi, I'm Candy Randolph, and today we're going to answer the question, why do we gain weight as we get older? Now, if you happen to be a woman in your 50s and beyond, you've gone through menopause, you're in midlife, and for you, nothing's changed. You can eat what you want, you can exercise or not, and pretty much you stay the same. You can probably check right out of this video and not worry about it, I guess. But for the rest of us who, um, as we go through our life, as we go through menopause, we're finished with menopause, we find that our body shape changes. We find that we put on some weight, mainly around the middle. And that can be a struggle for us to keep things under control. So the purpose of this video is to talk about the why. Because if we understand why we're gaining weight, and we learn that it is a natural process, we can then take action. We can make decisions about what we do, the kind of exercise we participate in, what we decide to eat, our nutrition, that will really help us keep that weight gain under control. So, first let's delve a little further into the why, why we gain weight, and then we'll also talk about what we can do. So, let's learn together. There are many reasons why women gain weight as they age. One of the main is perimenopause. This process starts actually years before your last menstrual cycle, and it can continue on for one up to four years. And this is when your hormones are beginning to fluctuate, causing weight gain. So this weight gain is called perimenopause weight or age-related weight gain. And unfortunately, it happens to all of us. Our estrogen levels drop as we get older. And when that happens, we might feel hungrier more often. So what do we do? We eat more. And as we eat more, we gain weight, especially if we don't make the wisest choices in what we choose to eat. And just as an aside, note the image um, on the left there is showing foods that are naturally rich in estrogen. Things like flax seeds, edamame, some dried fruits, peaches, berries, and wheat bran. Just a thought. Our metabolism naturally starts to slow. After the age of 30, typically every 10 years, it drops about 3%. Then once we reach our 60s, it drops more dramatically. So what happens? Your body then needs fewer calories to maintain your current weight. So the number of calories you can take in without gaining weight is decreasing along with your metabolism. So if you're thinking, well, I should be able to eat X amount of calories or this amount of food per, per day and be fine, that may no longer be true. Unfortunately, we lose muscle as we age. Yep, we do. Our muscle gets replaced with fat as we get older and we don't want that to happen. Strong muscles can help us avoid injury, um, minimize the chances of conditions like osteoporosis, sarcopenia. When we have more muscle on our body, two things happen. It keeps our metabolism running faster and it also burns more calories than other body tissue. So now that we understand why we gain weight as we get older, what can we do to prevent it or at least slow down the weight gain as we age. Well, I'm gonna tell you, my friend, the key is staying active. You can continue probably to do most of the activities that you en enjoyed in your younger years, but you'll have to work harder at them to keep your weight off. So let's look at several things we can do or changes we can make in our lives to control our weight and ultimately feel better about ourselves. Counting calories isn't a bad thing, and it may have helped you in your younger years lose weight, but as women over 50 and over 60, we should focus mainly on eating healthy, 
whole foods. So make wise choices with a balanced diet, including plenty of protein, veggies, fruit, and the good carbs, things like whole grains. Remember that staying fit and strong includes not only aerobics to get your heart rate up and get moving, but strength training. That is how you're going to increase your body strength and your muscles. And remember, you don't have to lift weights. You can, but you don't have to. You can increase your body strength just doing exercises with your own body weight. You can increase your strength doing a workout sitting in a chair. There are many ways you can do this, but this is absolutely key. The third key is to track your physical activity. Know how active you are. Know what you're doing throughout the day. Scheduled workout time is great. You know, I'm going to go to the gym for an hour or whatever, or I'm going to go for a walk for the next 30 minutes. That's great. But overall, you want to keep yourself accountable. Track your steps. Track your workouts. Write down or use an app to track your food intake and how much water you drink. It requires a little bit of effort. Um, I look at it as a part-time job, taking care of myself and my health as I get older. Keep it as simple as you want. Use a tracker if you want, but just do it. Weight gain as we age, yep, it's going to happen. It's a natural part of aging, but we can work to keep it under control. As I mentioned, it's like a part-time job, taking care of ourselves as we get older but it really is that important. We can't stop the aging process, but we can make wise lifestyle choices. 